Congratulations, Spanish Fork City. January's Business of the Month. Hi, I'm Jesse with the, the chair of the Chamber of Commerce this year, and I'm here with the mayor of Spanish Fork City, who is our Business of the Month. Congratulations, Mayor. Thank you. We really appreciate this honor. Yeah, like, we uh, do some nominations, we do some things, and the reason why a lot of people have told me that Spanish Fork City was nominated and voted on as uh, the Business of the Month is the PPE, things that you guys have been doing, shop local. Some people might not know about those programs. Can you tell us a little bit about what the city's deciding to do that was and what their role in that was? I'll let you hold that. You bet. Yeah, what we, uh, we received some uh, money from the CARES Act, and uh, so we were deciding on what was a good way we could uh, use that money for. And uh, we wanted, obviously, to help the businesses and uh, also the citizens. So we came up with the idea, oh, let's do these little uh, voucher coupons, $75 in three $25 coupons. And uh, we sent them out to all to uh, the residents and they were able to talk or take that month, those coupons to all the businesses that were participating in that and uh, be able to spend that. So the citizens uh, got some money out of that. The businesses got business out of that. And, you know, this uh, uh, program was a million dollars. So that's a uh, million dollars that got put into our economy here in Spanish Fork. So that was a pretty awesome uh, situation that we were able to use here in our city. We, uh, with the PPE, we c were able to distribute that to all the businesses that needed it. We were able to provide that for them so they didn't have to use that out of their own funds. And so that uh, helped them save during this time of the COVID. Um, one of the things that we've been able to do with, you know, combining with the Spanish Fork City and with the Chamber of Commerce is to distribute that, that that PPE to the to the businesses and every time a business comes in they are saying thank you thank you thank you because it's something that they don't have to worry about exactly. something that they can do to keep their employees and those that are patroning their businesses safe so thank you from the from our business community That's mayor how many uh, employees does the city actually employ well when you add them all up we're close to a thousand people they are employed by the city. When you talk about everybody that does everything in the city from our recreation program to everything else. So they have an impact on the whole city. So there's over a thousand people. And whatever we can do to help the businesses uh, be successful, that's what we're here for is because when the businesses are successful, Spanish work's successful. And you know, I've always said, you know, my goal was to always be able just to stay here in Spanish Fork. You can do all your shopping here, your entertaining here, your recreation here. And with the businesses we have here in Spanish Fork, we have some awesome businesses and they really help with that. Yeah, thank you. And like I said, just as a business community, we're so thankful for the cities that we get to work with, whether that's, you know, we have the rec departments or the street departments making sure that, you know, our streets are staying safe, that all those things are happening. So. You're representing the city today, but from the business community, thank you for what the city does to help us as a business grow um, and, and businesses to thrive in, in 2020 and in 2021 as we work through this pandemic. So thank you and make sure that the, the whole city staff know that as well as you're representing them today. Thank you, Mayor. Well, thank you. We appreciate this honor. It's a great honor. You know, I don't think that's ever happened before, and so we're pretty excited. Yeah, thank you. And we also want to say thank you to Macy's for providing a lovely white cake today.